Tonight we're going to be creating some art that um, I'm going to put on the wall of my daughter's room once I've finished redecorating it, so no pressure. Okay, so tonight I'm going to create, be creating a triptych and it's for my daughter. I'm redecorating her room at the moment and obviously my nine-year-old daughter, she's going for pinks and purples and all these really lovely bright colours. So I wanted to create a piece of art that would complement those colours and the way I'm going to do that is by creating um, the same pour across three canvases but one with a white background, one with a pink background and one with a lilac background. So even though they're going to have the same colours running across them, I think they're going to look really individual and create three different lovely looking paintings. Okay, that's the base all sorted out. I'm loving the, I'm loving how they look. Um, I'm gonna put them together slightly, pour some color across, and start blowing them out. See, see what, see what we end up with. They look great. I'd be so tempted to just leave them as they are. <laughs> just, but I'm definitely gonna blow them out. Oh, I just realized I didn't record my close-up camera for the, for the pouring, so apologies. And you're just gonna have to make do with my distance camera on that one. I'll have to sack my cameraman later on. or send him a stern email, one of the two. I'm just gonna bring them back together a little bit. I don't know how I'm going to do this, but I think I'm just going to blow up and down across the canvas. Start with the purple one and see see where see where we go. Well, they came out really well. Really happy with those. Well, I'm just gonna tweak the edges to try and bring the background color through a little bit more and maybe tweak the white over here where the turquoise is, is quite heavy and then see, see where we get, so you see what we end up with. But I'm really happy with that, really happy.
My daughter won't, won't be mad with me. Wow, this turned out great. I'm loving it. I'm, the, the lilac is my favourite. The composition is perfect. The white's my least favourite. The I think the paint kind of got away from me a little bit, but I'm going to leave it as it is because I think it just it's unique, isn't it? And I think that's what we that's what we're looking for with this is some uniqueness. So if they're all exactly the same and they were perfect, then it's probably something I could create on Photoshop. But this is this is one hit wonder this isn't happening again so i'm really really happy with this and i'm sure my daughter is going to be over the moon with them as well i'll let her know tomorrow that these were made for her she saw me mixing the paints but she didn't realize that i was doing a piece of art for her so that's going to be fantastic and um in the next video what i'll do is i'll, I'll grab the hair dryer again and we'll have another crack at creating a better version of that wimbledon painting with some green background, a split base green background with what I'm going to do is a more a very light a lilac colour and then the same colour composition in the middle. So we'll give that one a go, another go next time. But I really hope you like this one. Please drop me a like and a sub if you don't mind. And yeah, I'll see you for the next one. Thank you. I think they're going to look really individual and create three different lovely looking paintings. I keep saying lovely all the time. Three different paintings. <laughs> <laughs>